Being a world leader is no joke. For security, their vehicles must be top-notch, tightly secured and impressive beyond belief. And when it comes to travel, these world leaders know how to do it in style. They travel in unmatched luxury from sleek or gold-plated limos to sky-high private jets. These vehicles are more than just transport. They represent power and prestige. This is where every ride is a testament to leadership at its finest. Join us on this high-speed journey as we unveil 15 impressive presidential vehicles. Air Force One. Air Force One, the most globally recognized VIP aircraft, is not just a plane. It's a symbol of unparalleled power and prestige. The leader of the United States often needs to visit multiple countries during their term, and Air Force One is designed to meet these demanding requirements. For decades, it has faithfully served American presidents, functioning as a flying White House. While any aircraft carrying the president is referred to as Air Force One, the current iteration is the Boeing 747 200 often known as the VC 25a what sets it apart is not just its size but its advanced technology its modernized wings and engines grant it 17% more power enabling takeoffs and landings on remarkably short runways Air Force One can reach speeds of Mach 1 making it the fastest passenger jet in the world this speed and agility are vital ensuring the president can swiftly respond to any situation security is paramount and this iconic air aircraft surely doesn't disappoint with its fortified electronic shield against electromagnetic pulses, transforming it into a secure mobile command center during attacks. It boasts an array of defense systems, including a radar jammer and countermeasures against heat-seeking missiles. Its communication facilities are equipped with cutting-edge hardware, ensuring uninterrupted connectivity. Air Force One's unique ability to be refueled mid-flight allows it to remain airborne as long as necessary. Beyond security, luxury is another benefit of traveling with this vehicle. With a space 4,000 square feet of space on three stories, including an extensive presidential suite. This suite includes a spacious office, a lavatory, and a conference room. Air Force One also features a medical suite capable of functioning as an operating room, staffed with a dedicated doctor. But it's not all about functionality. Air Force One offers luxury on a grand scale. Recently, Aircraft One has undergone lots of transformation, and do you know? It is more impressive now. Its overhaul cost about $1.4 billion. To put this in perspective, it's larger than an NBA basket court. Oh wow. Hungry passengers on board can rely on Air Force One's two food preparation galleys, capable of feeding up to 100 people at any given time. Additionally, separate quarters are provided for the President's advisors, and a detachment of cargo planes ensures the President has everything they need. In essence, the Air Force serves as a mobile fortress for the President of the United States. It's a plane that not only ensures the safety and security of the nation's leader, but also allows them to carry out their duties with unparalleled efficiency and comfort, even while soaring through the skies. It is safe to say that they are really living the life. Angela Merkel's armored Audi, A8LW12 security. Angela Merkel, the stalwart leader of Germany since November 2005, commands her nation with a blend of resilience and elegance. Her trusted companion in this journey is none other than the $750,000 Audi A8LW12 security, a vehicle that defies its sleek exterior with its formidable capabilities. It's not merely a car, it's a fortress on wheels, impervious to heavy bullets, hand grenades, explosives, and even noxious gases. What truly sets this marvel apart are its bulletproof windows, a staggering 62 millimeters thick, coupled with a full suit of aluminum body armor. These bulletproof windows ensure Merkel's safety while maintaining a stylish, unnoticeable appearance. They are engineered with a special coating to prevent spalling, and the side windows can be lowered nearly all the way, thanks to the electromechanical mechanism. Inside, opulence reigns with a four-zone auto air conditioning system, complete with an air freshening ionizer, electric rear blinds and a cutting-edge Bose surround sound system. The Audi A8 LW12 security is a haven of luxury, with individual power-adjustable rear seats, heating and even massage options available. Beyond Merkel's Audi lies the budget-friendly yet advanced BMW 5 Series, a testament to the leaps in German automotive engineering, priced at around $40,000. Supporting Merkel's security detail are three Mercedes Vi-Class vehicles, collectively valued at over $150,000. These vehicles boast the capacity to accommodate seven individuals, ensuring readiness for any situation. However, it's not just about security, it's about sustainability too. The Mercedes Vi-Class champions a forward-thinking approach, prioritizing a reduced carbon footprint. This fleet of vehicles represents the pinnacle of automotive engineering, a fusion of sophistication and cutting-edge technology. In choosing these vehicles, Merkel not only displays her confidence in German automakers, but also underlines the nation's unwavering commitment to the safety and well-being of its leaders. As she continues 
continues to navigate the challenges of her role, Angela Merkel does so with the assurance of top-tier technology and unmatched style. Her fleet stands as a testament to Germany's dedication to both security and sustainability, a reflection of the nation's unwavering values. Sultan of Brunei's Rolls-Royce Silver Spur II. At first glance, it might seem surprising that the Sultan of Brunei finds a place on this list. After all, Brunei is a relatively small country, both in terms of population, with around 452,524 people, and geographical size. Moreover, it's not the most influential nation in Asia. However, beneath its unassuming exterior lies immense wealth, thanks to abundant oil reserves. And it's this wealth that has turned the Sultan of Brunei into one of the world's wealthiest individuals. While one might might hope that such wealth would be directed toward the betterment of the nation, the Sultan has a penchant for the finer things in life, particularly when it comes to automobiles. His car collection is nothing short of astonishing, boasting over 7,000 vehicles, with an estimated combined value surpassing a staggering $5 billion. It's a collection that holds the title of the largest private car collection globally, a testament to the Sultan's extravagant taste. One standout gem in this opulent fleet is the Rolls-Royce Silver Spur II, a symbol of sheer luxury, customized for the the Sultan's wedding day, this limousine is no ordinary ride. Originally ordered for his wedding day, this custom limousine is no ordinary vehicle. It's a stretch limo coated in 24 karat gold with a jaw-dropping price tag of $14 million. It's a testament to the Sultan's desire for the extraordinary, even when it comes to his mode of transportation. However, despite its lavish detailing and gilded exterior, this remarkable car doesn't see much action on the road. The Sultan's need for speed takes him in different directions, making Rolls-Royce more about making a statement than setting land speed records. It cruises at a leisurely pace, allowing onlookers to fully absorb the exquisite craftsmanship and extravagant detailing. The Sultan of Brunei was able to acquire this $14 million automotive masterpiece when he held the title of the world's richest individual. His collection, anchored by the Rolls-Royce Silver Spur II, solidifies his reputation as a connoisseur of automotive excellence. It's undeniable that when it comes to vehicle collections, the Sultan's fleet reigns supreme, standing alone in its extravagance and grandeur. While you may be wowed by this impressive ride, wait until you see Vladimir Putin's rides, Vladimir Putin's Aura Senate. Vladimir Putin, known for his authoritative leadership, doesn't just roll in any motorcade. His convoy may be smaller, but it packs a powerful punch. At its heart is the Aura Senate, a custom-built marvel designed exclusively for the Russian president. Crafted by the engineering wizards at Porsche and Russia's Nami, this limousine is a heavyweight at six tons and an impressive 23 feet long. There's ample room for Putin, his entourage, and of course his security detail. The security features features of the Senate are a closely guarded secret, a testament to its cutting-edge technology. Powered by a 4.4-litre V8 engine, it's not just a city cruiser, it's built for off-road excursions if the need arises. This bespoke marvel comes with a hefty price tag and the price tag, a cool $10 million a sum that could easily buy you a mansion. But for Putin, it's an investment in his safety and prestige. Accompanying the Aura Senate in Putin's motorcade are three Mercedes G-Classes, luxury SUVs capable of tackling any terrain. Each one costs upwards of $140,000 and boasts a top speed of 137 miles per hour, perfect for a presidential pursuit. To ensure smooth passage, there's a modest police detail of just six motorcycles. While Putin's motorcade might not be the grandest in the world, it's certainly fit for a cameo in a Fast and Furious film. The Aura Senate, a product of Russia's Nami, is a luxury full-size car that's earned its stripes as the official state car of the Russian president. Its armored version is a technological marvel, equipped with a 4.4-liter V8 engine with a monstrous 6.6-litre V12 option on the horizon. This automotive masterpiece, part of the Cortege series, was unveiled in 2018 and has since become a symbol of Russian engineering prowess. In a world where luxury meets security, the Aura Senate stands as a testament to engineering ingenuity and presidential prestige. For those seeking top-tier protection without compromising on opulence, this vehicle is the epitome of both. Putin's Aura Senate isn't just a car, it's a fortress on four wheels. When Putin rides, even speed itself takes a back seat. The Beast. In the world of presidential vehicles, one car reigns supreme, the aptly named Beast. This isn't your average automobile. It's a fortress on wheels designed to safeguard the Commander-in-Chief of the United States, whoever that may be at the time. Crafted by Cadillac, the Beast is no ordinary luxury car. It's a rolling fortress with a price tag of around $1.6 million. This is the updated version of the 2009 model, equipped with a slew of security features that would put any James Bond vehicle to shame. Let's start with the basics. The exterior 
Fear of the Beast is a formidable force with walls that are a whopping 200 millimeters thick. The windows, they're no less impressive at 130 millimeters of bulletproof glass. The car's body, boasting eight inches thick of armor, adds up to a staggering curb weight of approximately nine tons. This vehicle lives up to its name. It's practically indestructible. But wait, there's more. The doors are very solid, equivalent to the cabin door of a Boeing 747. When it comes to security, nothing is getting through without the president's say. The beast's fuel tank is even protected by explosion prevention foam, capable of withstanding a direct hit from an RPG. The Kevlar reinforced tires are equally robust and impervious to projectiles or blasts. Safety doesn't stop at defense, it extends to the interior. The Beast features a secure environmental system that shields occupants from chemicals and gas attacks, providing a steady oxygen supply. It even carries an emergency blood supply with the President's blood type. Talk about preparedness. But this isn't just a defensive machine, it has offensive capabilities too. Equipped with pump-action shotguns, tear gas launchers and a night vision camera, the Beast can handle more than just a leisurely drive through Washington, D.C. It even boasts an oil slick option for those tricky getaways. Now, while the Beast is a marvel of security, it's no speed demon. With a max speed of just 60 meters per hour and an efficiency rating of about 3.7 to 8 miles per U.S. gallon, it won't be winning any drag races. But when it comes to protecting the leader of the free world, speed takes a back seat. In the world of presidential transportation, the Beast is the ultimate bodyguard on wheels. It may have its quirks and limitations, but when it comes to safeguarding the president, it's a force to be reckoned with. A true symbol of power and protection, even if it occasionally breaks down on the job. Xi Jinping's Hongqi L5. Step into the world of luxury on wheels with China's President Xi Jinping and his fleet of Hongqi L5 sedans. These automotive marvels, five in total, add up to a staggering $4 million, standing tall as the pinnacle of Chinese automotive opulence. But the true marvel lies beneath the surface. Under the hood, the Hongqi L5 roars to life with a 4-liter twin-turbo V8 engine, unleashing a powerful 381 horse. Paired with an 8-speed automatic transmission, this car is a force to be reckoned with on the road. When President Xi embarks on major events and high-stakes meetings, he's flanked by his dedicated motorcade, a fleet of high-end vehicles ensuring his safety. While he may not be cruising in a bespoke automobile like some of his global counterparts, the price tag is still impressive. Picture this, a parade of state police, their motorcycles and vehicles leading the way with blazing sirens. Among them, only one proudly carries the five-star red flag of the People's Republic of China. The police astride them lead the charge, each bike ringing in at a cool 14 grand. And let's not forget the fleet of understated cars and vans carrying his security detail, cabinet members, and even a standby ambulance just in case. Rolling onto the scene in 2013 at the Shanghai Auto Show, the L5 emerged as the crown jewel of Chinese automotive craftsmanship, commanding a hefty price tag of CN Yen 5 million renminbi. That's roughly 800,000 US dollars or UK pound 580,000. As the official state car of China, it's the favored ride of General Secretary Xi Jinping, the paramount leader of the Communist Party. Beyond the borders of China, the L5 makes a mark. Exported to Belarus as a donation, it proudly parades as a symbol of military grandeur during national celebrations. This automotive powerhouse weighs just shy of 3.2 tons, with its mighty 6-liter V12 engine propelling it forward. While comfort may take a back seat with its firm upholstery and a few quirks, it's not about speed. This car commands attention with sheer presence. President Emmanuel Macron's DS7 Coursback, French President Emmanuel Macron has broken the mold when it comes to his official car. While many of his global counterparts opt for the traditional limousine, Macron has chosen the remarkable DS7 Crossback as his presidential ride. This choice not only sets him apart, but also underscores his commitment to environmental responsibility. So what sets the DS7 Crossback apart as the chosen vehicle for France's leader? To begin with, it's no ordinary SUV. It's been extended in length, transforming it into a bespoke symbol of presidential power and prestige. But it's not just about appearances. This vehicle is built like a bulletproof fortress to ensure the president's safety. What truly makes Macron's DS7 Crossback a standout choice is its eco-friendly heart. Macron is a staunch advocate for environmental conservation and his presidential vehicle reflects that dedication. This 4x4 vehicle boasts an intense plug-in hybrid powertrain. Two electric motors, working in harmony with a 1.6-liter four-cylinder engine, deliver a respectable 300 horsepower. While it might not be the fastest presidential vehicle globally, it's undoubtedly one of the greenest. The the DS7 Crossback made its debut in November 2021, marking a relatively recent addition to the presidential fleet. The civilian version of this luxury SUV comes with a price tag of around $74,000. However, when it comes to Macron's personal suite on wheels, the price tag skyrockets into the stratosphere. At his inauguration in 2017, Macron made a
a statement by gliding down the iconic Champs-Élysées in the DS7 Crossback Presidencia. The latest iteration, known as DS7 Crossback Élysée, takes things up a notch with a 300-horsepower E-Tense plug-in hybrid power unit, ensuring four-wheel drive capabilities. The Regal Ink Blue paintwork further enhances the vehicle's aura of power and prestige. Emmanuel Macron's DS7 Crossback is a potent mix of elegance, safety and environmental mindfulness. It's not just a car, it's a testament to his dedication to a greener future and a fresh era in presidential travel. Queen Elizabeth's Bentley State Limousine Queen Elizabeth's Bentley State Limousine is the epitome of regal elegance. This unique ride, one of only two in existence, was gifted to Her Majesty in 2002, commemorating her 50-year reign. Powered by a 6.7-litre V8 engine, it commands a formidable 400 horsepower, embodying both power and prestige. What sets this limousine apart is its bespoke features tailored to the Queen's stature. Doors are uniquely designed to allow her to stand before disembarking, ensuring a dignified entrance. They also offer panoramic visibility, allowing passers-by to catch a glimpse of Her Majesty as she glides along the road. Safety is paramount in these vehicles, evident in their bullet and blast proofing. The cabin meticulously crafted is airtight, providing an extra layer of security. Standing taller, wider and longer than the standard Bentley Arnage, the state limousine exudes an aura of grandeur. With broad coach doors that open nearly 90 degrees, it offers an impressive entry. Under the hood, the twin turbocharged V8 engine, modified from Bentley's Arnage R version, generates an impressive 616 lbf of torque. While it may not rival sports cars in speed, it commands a maximum of 130 miles per hour, making it a dignified ride fit for a queen. This Bentley isn't just a car, it's a symbol of royalty, embodying the essence of Queen Elizabeth's reign. Used primarily for official engagements, it's always escorted by a fleet of Royal Protection Squad vehicles and outriders. The Bentleys also found their way to royal residences like Balmoral and Sandringham House. In a nod to sustainability, both limousines were converted to run on biofuel, aligning with environmental initiatives. Valued at £10 million pounds each, which is roughly equivalent to $10,744,710. These state limousines are not just vehicles, they are testaments to a reign marked by grace, power, and an unwavering commitment to tradition. They stand as enduring symbols of Queen Elizabeth's legacy. Theresa May's Jaguar XJ Sentinel now let's shift gears to another showstopper in our countdown. Former British Prime Minister Theresa May made a statement with her convoy, showing that you don't need to break the bank for top-notch security and style. While her personal Jaguar XJ Sentinel may not have cost a million dollars, it was anything but ordinary. Custom designed with Kevlar backing and blast protection, it ensured her safety without compromising speed, topping 120 miles per hour. This sleek Sentinel on wheels, priced at a reasonable $455,025, was a fitting choice for a leader of May's stature. Its formidable presence would have seemed more at home in a James Bond film than as a mode of transport for a head of state, but it was a testament to her position as the highest-ranking official in the country. Her entourage included three Range Rover Sports, a collective investment of approximately $225,000. These British icons not only transported her colleagues and staff, but also provided a cocoon of security. With a reputation for both speed and sophistication, the Range Rover is a symbol of British automotive excellence. And what's a motorcade without the iconic British touch? Leading the way are four 2016 BMW R1200 RTP motorcycles to British precision and class. These BMWs serve as advanced scouts, ensuring a smooth and secure path for the former Prime Minister. They also help maintain order and clear the roads of any overzealous onlookers. The total bill for the quartet of BMW motorcycles comes comes to about $60,000, a wise investment in ensuring the safety and efficiency of the Prime Minister's travels. May's convoy was a shining example of balancing safety and luxury while being prudent with taxpayer funds. It showcased that a leader can move securely and in style without breaking the bank. In a world of extravagant motorcades, May's choice was a refreshing reminder of practicality and purpose. So, whether it's the sleek Jaguar, the Regal Range Rovers, or the precision BMW motorcycles, this convoy exemplifies that security and style can go hand in hand. Prince Alwaleed's Boeing 747. In the realm of opulence, the Saudi royal family reigns supreme, amassing a staggering fortune of approximately a trillion dollars. While their fleet of planes rivals mansions in the sky, there's one aircraft that stands as the crown jewel in the collection, Prince Al-Walid's private Boeing 747. Prince Al-Walid's aerial masterpiece cost an estimated price of $220 million. For someone of his wealth, it was a modest investment. However, the prince, accustomed to the grandeur of palaces, felt the need for a personal touch. He embarked on a journey to remodel 
remodel and refit the interior, transforming it into a flying palace befitting his royal stature. This Boeing 747 isn't just a means of transportation, it's a veritable home in the sky. Inside, it boasts multiple luxurious bedrooms complete with full bathrooms. A dining area designed to seat 14 ensures lavish feasts, while lounges exude extravagance at every turn. A majestic chandelier casts a regal glow and gold accents adorn every corner. And of course, let's not forget the piece de resistance, a throne room. Yes, you read that correctly. A throne room on board the Saudi Prince's Boeing 747 serves as a constant reminder of his royal heritage, wherever he may roam. But the opulence doesn't stop there. This floating palace has a spacious salon, and master suites boasting king-sized beds, private bathrooms, and even showers for ultimate comfort. Below the cockpit, an ambient living room beckons with two plush sofas and elegant lamps, creating an inviting atmosphere for relaxation or business discussions. The formal dining area features an expansive table -like ideal for high-level meetings, and the sumptuous armchairs upholstered in leather offer unrivaled comfort. Meanwhile, the upper deck houses a well-stocked bar for socializing, ensuring that every aspect of luxury is catered to. For the devout prince, there's also a dedicated prayer area, with an electronic system ensuring that it always points toward Mecca. It's a testament to the meticulous attention to detail that transforms this Boeing 747 into a heavenly abode above the clouds. In the world of private jets, Prince Al-Walid's Boeing 700 147 is an epitome of opulence and luxury, reflecting his royal lineage and his unwavering commitment to a lifestyle truly fit for a prince. Kim Jong-un's Mercedes-Benz S 600 Pullman Guard. In the world of motorcades, Kim Jong-un's procession is a sight to behold. Picture this, his elite guard literally keeping pace, making it quite the spectacle. But the real star of the show? His trusty Mercedes-Benz S 600 Pullman Guard. When Kim's on the move, this is his go-to ride for public appearances and press conferences. And let's just say, it's a head-turner. After all, the man knows a thing or two about making an entrance. This beast purrs with a 500-horsepower twin-turbocharged V12 engine, delivering power fit for a leader. But let's talk size. This car is a behemoth. Stretching out at a staggering 21 feet and weighing in at five and a half tons, it's not for the faint of heart. Why? Because it's fortified to the hilt. Armored protection is seamlessly integrated with steel panels guarding every inch. Even the floors are armored just in case. The laminated glass windows, they're a fortress in their own right, coated with polycarbonate to defy any attempt at shattering. Mercedes proudly boasts that the Pullman Guard is certified at resistance class VR9 and blast-proof to meet the ERV 2010 standards. In simpler terms, this car is a fortress on wheels. But wait, there's more. Step inside and you'll find a luxurious interior as impressive as its exterior toughness. Captain's chairs beckon with their reclining comfort and the rear cabin. It's been outfitted with rear-facing jump seats, maximizing its capacity. The price tag? This Pullman Guard starts at $1.6 million, and that's the standard version. Imagine the dent in the budget for this presidential edition. Kim Jong-un may have an eye for appearances, but he's also rolling in one of the toughest and yes most stunning cars in the entire country this mercedes-benz pullman guard is a blend of brawn and beauty it's a testament to the lengths leaders go to in order to make a statement both inside and outside their armored chariots Chancellor Olaf Schultz's Mercedes 680 guard. Chancellor Olaf Schultz's motorcade boasts an extraordinary gem in the form of the Mercedes 680 guard, a pinnacle of automotive security and luxury. This magnificent armored vehicle created by Mercedes stands as a testament to cutting edge protection and opulence. Inside this marvel, Chancellor Schultz finds unrivaled safety, encapsulated in layers of body armor capable of withstanding hundreds of rounds from automatic weapons. The Mercedes 680 guard ensures the Chancellor's well-being during those crucial first 30 seconds of any potential threat, allowing time for swift responses from bodyguards and law enforcement. But it doesn't stop there. In the event of a poison gas attack, this remarkable vehicle releases life-sustaining oxygen while maintaining safe pressure levels, shielding the Chancellor from harm. It contains a 12-cylinder engine, boasting an impressive 680 horsepower, designed to deliver both luxury and rapid mobility for Chancellor Schultz and his team. This Mercedes 680 80 guard represents the pinnacle of security, surpassing its predecessors with upgraded features that make it one of the most formidable and secure vehicles available. With a price tag of 550,000 euros, that is about $585,349.05, it stands shoulder to shoulder with presidential vehicles worldwide, a symbol of the uncompromising commitment to safety and excellence. Now let's delve into the intricacies of its windshield, which alone tips the scales at over 250 pounds. The Mercedes 600 
680 Guard boasts a top-tier VR-10 grade of armor, capable of withstanding assaults from assault rifles and even explosives. It comes prepared with countermeasures to thwart smoke attacks and can continue running even with flat tires. This customized Marvel tailored to the highest office in Germany is powered by a 6-liter V12 engine, coupled with a seamless 9-speed automatic transmission. What's more, it features a groundbreaking 4-matic all-wheel drive system, ensuring that despite its considerable weight, it remains nimble and agile. This vehicle proudly signifies the lengths taken to ensure the utmost security and comfort for one of the nation's most prominent figures, Narendra Modi's Mercedes Maybach S 650 Guard. Presenting the pinnacle of automotive security and luxury, the Mercedes Maybach S 650 Guard now gracing the convoy of India's esteemed Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Welcomed into Modi's fleet in December 2021, this opulent vehicle has since become the official transport of the Indian Prime Minister's security detail. While Modi previously traversed in a Range Rover Vogue and Toyota Land Cruiser, the Mercedes Maybach S650 Guard represents a significant upgrade, particularly in terms of security. One of the standout features of Modi's new Maybach S650 Guard is its VR10 level of ballistic protection, the highest grade available for a civilian vehicle. Both its body shell and glass housing can endure hardened steel core bullets of TNT explosives from a distance of 2 meters. Military rifles stand no chance against its fortifications. The S650 Guard's doors are so substantial that they necessitate an electric motor for operation. Within its core lies a potent 6-liter V12 engine, delivering an impressive output of 500 23 brake horsepower. The fuel tank is entirely self-sealing, adding another layer of defense. In the event of a gas or chemical attack, the internal emergency fresh air system ensures the interior remains a safe haven. This armored masterpiece ensures Prime Minister Modi's safety at the highest level. Customized to meet his exacting standards, the interior is replete with rich amenities promising a comfortable and lavish ride for official engagements and travels. The vehicle's price tag, though not really known, it is said to exceed ours. 12 crories, which is equivalent to 1,443,784.80 US dollars, attests to its exclusivity and advanced security features, cementing its status as one of the most coveted vehicles worldwide. Prime Minister Modi's Mercedes Maybach S650 Guard offers not only impeccable security, but also a luxurious travel experience. It's an extraordinary fusion of cutting-edge protection and opulence, embodying a commitment to safeguarding one of the world's most influential figures. With its exceptional features and outstanding craftsmanship, this vehicle stands as a testament to the intersection of security, comfort and extravagance in the realm of world-leading transportation. The leader of India is surely leading in a majestic way. Scott Morrison's BMW 7 Series. Scott Morrison, Australia's former Prime Minister, cruised through the streets in a dazzling white BMW 7 Series, complete with the proud Australian flag mounted on its nose. It is a 3.6-ton behemoth known as Commonwealth One, boasting blast resistance fit for a head of state. In fact, there are nine of these specially crafted 7 Series stationed on Australian soil, each tailored to varying levels of protection. And let's not forget the armoured BMW X5 SUVs that share the fleet. While the finer details of this high-security vehicle remain shrouded in secrecy, insiders suggest it surpasses even the stringent standards of VR4, 6 and 9 certified vehicles. The veil of confidentiality surrounding this vehicle is intentional, yet some insights have emerged. The 7 Series High Security comes in three formidable tiers, VR4, VR6 and the formidable VR7-9. Though Morrison's specific model remains confidential, it's a fair bet that Albanese's Commonwealth One isn't your run of the mill Beamer. This fortress on wheels commands a price north of $500,000. It seems like a shrewd investment. After all, can you really put a price on safety? Those opting for this level of security must inform the government of their acquisition, as per Australian regulations. The vehicle's extraordinary features are certainly out of the world. It's equipped with sensors capable of detecting toxic gases, ensuring a sealed cabin with a reserve of up to two hours of oxygen. In the face of danger, it extinguishes fires, conceals weapons, and barrels forward for 50, 80 kilometers, even with bullet-riddled tires. It bodies a 6.0-liter twin-turbo V12 engine, churning out a formidable 560 horsepower, Propelling the 7 Series from 0 to 60 in a swift 6 seconds. Impressive given its hulking 4-ton frame, crafted in Germany by a team of 50 specialized technicians, each 7 Series high security undergoes rigorous testing, retains its factory warranty and remarkably preserves BMW's renowned driver-centric dynamics. Its doors weigh a quarter of a ton and promise bone-breaking force, earning the vehicle classification as a potential weapon in some jurisdictions. Even a single window tips the scales at 150 kilograms to fortify against 
against fuel tank vulnerabilities, BMW outfits its armoured marvels with self-sealing compounds. Inasmuch as this car is exquisite, it is good to notice that it does not only look good, but is also equipped to protect and safeguard the now Prime Minister of Australia, Emperor Naruhito's Toyota Century Royal. Emperor Naruhito of Japan knows how to make an entrance, and it's no surprise considering his exquisite choice of wheels. Nestled in the plush confines of a specially tailored Toyota Century sedan, known as the Century Royal, the Emperor is met with grandeur as he ascends the stately granite steps. Inside, the opulence continues with wool upholstery and a delicate rice paper headline Liner that exudes an air of regality. What sets these vehicles apart is their purpose-driven design, each one crafted for specific occasions. But luxury is just the beginning. The Century Royal is shrouded in secrecy, boasting an array of undisclosed defensive measures. Given the Emperor's pivotal role in Japan, rest assured that this is the epitome of safety on wheels. Powered by a robust V8 engine, these models also feature a hybrid system, an eco-conscious touch that doesn't compromise on power. The Century's legacy continues with the third generation, unveiled in a grand reveal at the 2017 Tokyo Motor Show. It hit the market in June 2018, offering a range from 19,600,000 yen $132,959.54 to the top-tier Century Limousine at 60 million yen $407,007.30. Limited to just 50 units per month, each is meticulously handcrafted, epitomizing automotive artistry. This iteration pays homage to its predecessor, the Century Royal, a bespoke creation commissioned by the Japanese Imperial Household Agency in 2006. Technological upgrades seamlessly blend with timeless aesthetics, featuring Toyota Safety Sense P-Series collision avoidance support and Toyota T-Connect. The familiar side-view mirrors find a new home on the doors, incorporating turn signal lights for a fresh, modern look. Rear passenger comfort takes precedence with reclining seats, integrated heaters and massage functions. A power leg rest ensures ultimate relaxation, while a 20-speaker sound system envelops occupants in audio bliss. A generous 20-inch LCD screen puts control at the fingertips of rear seat passengers, allowing them to fine-tune their experience. In crafting the century, Toyota has not only built a car, they've created a masterpiece a testament to Japanese engineering excellence and an ode to a regal heritage. For more videos like this, where we explore the extravagant lifestyles of the affluent, just click on the videos displayed on your screen. Keep watching, we are coming back with more. See you soon.